Hi guys, it's Barnaby. I'm back from LA. Look at my tan. Check this out. I was in LA for 10 days and I am even paler than I was before I left. But never mind. This is Tottenham Transfer Talk. It's Tuesday. It's pretty quiet. But first up, little hail. Andros Townsend, everyone. Uh, BBC and Sky Sports saying it's a done deal. Well, they're not saying it's a done deal. It's an agreed fee between Mike Ashley and Daniel Levy. £12 million for Andros to go up north, play with John Joe Shelby and a load of Frenchmen. Good luck to you, Andros. You are a Spurs fan. You've always tried your nuts off for us. Worked really hard. You scored against Chelsea last year in the 5-3. You were taking those penalties. You are a good player. I rate you, but it just went awry somewhere. And you want to play in the Euros, and your best chance is to get first-team football. So... Fair play to you. I hope you do well. I hope Daniel Levy's smacked a massive sell-on percentage on there. So when you do score 10 goals this season or next season or whatever, someone will come and buy you. We get 25% on the back end. Everybody's happy. Andros, 12 million. Good deal. I think everyone's happy with that. Well done, mate. Second bit of news today. According to the Daily Mirror, we are after Galatasaray striker Burak Yilmaz. Uh, he, uh, he's 30 years old. He scored 139 goals in 233 games for Galatasaray and apparently West Ham are also interested. Now whenever we're interested in the same players as someone like West Ham I just think this cannot be true because why would we be interested in fodder like that? He's also 30 years old, that is not a Paul Mitchell signing, that is not a Spurs signing where we sign young, it's just unlikely. If I had to rate this transfer I'd say one out of five. I could be wrong, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Guys, usually we do three bits of transfer news in every Tottenham transfer talk. Well, yesterday there was so little news we didn't even do one. Today I've only got two bits of news, so why don't you let me know what rumours you've heard on the grapevine, because it's all gone slow. My Tottenham sources, they're not talking to me, they're annoyed I went off to LA, so I've got a little bit of work to do in terms of my contacts, but you let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube, follow us on Twitter, at TV. Come on you Spurs. But that moment of magic, he kind of just flicked it up, volleyed it over one of their players' heads, Cameron 